So hey, this is the Devil's Triangle. Uh, I did not come up with this circuit. A guy named Paul. Paul in the lab. Thanks to Paul. This is a wonderful circuit. Uh, check his website out if you, you build stuff. Paul in the lab. Uh, fantastic. Really great uh, circuits that he's come up with there. So this is three oscillators. There's three chips. And then the fourth chip's like a mixer to mix them all together, I think. Uh, usually it's, I, this is the second one that I built. The other one is in like a big box with a sub speaker and you tune these oscillators and get them to kind of jive and then come out of sync and it, it's just the coolest thing, especially through a delay. Now that box, I plan to put up just a bunch of stuff in there, like a RCA patch bay. I know that that's a bad idea, but I got a mixer in it, but it's got a bunch of stuff, but it's going to be kind of like a, just a home for a lot of my noisemaker circuits with the amp and speakers built in. Anyway, uh, I got impatient because I know that project is going to take me a real long time to complete. And I had the parts, so I, I put together another, another Devil's Triangle because I found this. Now this, I'm not sure what this is from. It's some kind of an aviation video game controller throttle. Um, it was two dollars. It was a dollar ninety-eight from Goodwill, and and there's there's pots in it control board so I just cut those pots tested them they're 10k now the devil's triangle calls for 100k I actually use I think 200k or 500k maybe even a 1m I kind of modified mine to give it a, a wider range of pitch uh, on one of the oscillators I think now <clears throat> the 10k is way too small that would be a tenth because it calls for 100 so what I did I used something called a Vactral I had this idea while we were watching a movie um, it's an LED on one end, and then the other end is a light sensor. That's just like a knob or a control. It's the same thing as a pot, what the circuit calls for, kind of. So what I did, I built three circuits, because there's three controls, with these Vactrols. It's a 7805 voltage regulator with this 10K pot in here. So when I adjust this, um, it lights up that LED, brighter dim, and then that sensor sends the signal back the resistance to the devil's triangle so let's hear what it sounds like this is going to be just a quick demo touching it. And that's the master power. So basically, I have to build a master uh, power supply just for the voltage regulator. So I'll probably use a, I think it's called an LM317, and whatever resistor you use, you can get between 0 and 25 or 30 volts. 
um, something like that. I'll probably go between 0 and 15 and then use whatever value pot as a master tone control. And then each one of these will have another, like a larger knob, uh, to fine tune it or, you know, wide range control. Because, like, these are 10K. So it's really, I really should dis completely disassemble that and put some larger value. Like, if, I, if this was 100K pots, I could have just wired it up. Um, so it's a little bit more complicated. I think I'm going to make this detachable, which it's nine, nine connections. A pot has three wires. So, excuse me. I got some connectors. They have a dozen connections on them. I'm going to have to solder that all up and mount this. I think I'm going to mount it in like a little briefcase. And then I'm going to add a sine wave, like a, <clears throat> kind of like a theremin type of an idea. There's going to be an echo unit. I've got a one second PT. 2399, maybe 700 millisecond uh, LFO modulation delay I'm going to put in there. And then I'm going to add a, a, a fourth sine wave oscillator. Real nice sounding, uh, almost vocal, sounds like a woman singing at certain timbres. And I'll use, a, there'll be a rod uh, that slides in and out of a tube with an LED and then one of those light sensors. And that will be how you can control the pitch with a momentary, you know, to fire it off a little button. Uh, so this is going to come together over the next hopefully a year and you know i made some pretty good progress tonight i just made a post about this on facebook so i i wanted to uh, show that i followed through so stay tuned for uh i don't know what i'm going to call it it's not going to be called the devil's triangle because there's going to be four oscillators so devil's suitcase that's a terrible idea all right you guys take care happy new year <clears throat>